all right guys Farla 84 dropped a hot fix patch uh for update 2.0 now if you guys remember back about a week ago we just did the podcast with our boy sack wilder private ryan rusty and special guest uh lacy cast so if you guys haven't checked that one out i will leave a link to it in the description below uh but this was kind of uh you know foreseen and and spoken about it by lacy cast they have a vision they want to update some of the current characters and for this particular patch duck side's gonna get an update so i want to cover that very shortly with you guys and show you a little bit of the changes what it looks like uh, now versus what it used to look like before let's get into it <laughs> All right, guys, so let's take a quick look at what this patch is all about. Um, as you guys know, there's a lot of bugs in the game. I don't feel like the audio is in its best state right now. Me also as a controller player, I noticed that when you ping, you know, unfortunately, sometimes you ping and then your character gets stuck. So some, some of those bugs hopefully get fixed down the line. But they're starting with a couple of updates. And this one in particular is going to be about mainly dog side. There is one bug fix that they tackled. They fixed an issue in the legend pack interface where the model size of the war spider R skin warning was inaccurately large. So uh, to be honest, I didn't notice this bug. As I said, you know, there's uh, other bugs that I know I'm aware of and, and I've seen for myself, but this one's one that they needed to fix. Now talking about hero balance adjustments. And like I said, they mentioned this, uh, you know, speaking to Lazy Cast uh, Lab podcast. They really want to ensure that there's a nice balance to each character. Right now, Duckside is probably one of the most prominent and, and paid characters in the game. With the universal movement of the jetpacks being removed to the game, Maggie and Duckside are still very much um, you know, movement heavy, right? That's what their kit is based on. So let's see what the changes are all about. We have increased duration of acceleration devices created along the movement path after casting tactical skill. Full speed charge. So the path is gonna stay on instead of four seconds for six seconds which i think it's a w for teammates you know this is gonna be a benefit to your teammates more than anything decreasing the, the continuous acceleration effect provided by the tactical skill full charge goes from 25 to 20 percent so you know there's just that give and take you probably won't even notice this too much but i definitely wanted to showcase it to you guys so i'll show you guys um the before and after in a second and then the last thing reducing the initial acceleration provided by tactical skill full speed charge for duck side significantly so you know they say significantly we'll see i have a, a comparison of a before and after you guys tell me what you think about you know what this movement looks like here let's take a quick look all right so at first glance you can definitely tell that you know the initial acceleration has been reduced i wouldn't say any it's anything drastic though but it's noticeable and you know on before you could have a, like like a nice little uh, speed dash i think like you can dash out of buildings a lot quicker too but this move is now more of a tactical move and in my eyes i think it's more of a move to help your teammates more than duck side too so as you guys can probably tell the rings are staying you know for a lot longer going from four seconds to six seconds i think it's a w so if your teammates are a little bit far behind it gives them a little bit of time to catch up and be able to go through the rings and get the speed boot for themselves so i think they're just trying to introduce a lot a lot of team play with this particular update and this is just part of it so in my opinion, it doesn't change Duckside um, to its core. I think Duckside is still going to be Duckside. I think the high rate um, for him being picked is going to continue to be a good thing. I just think with this minimal changes that they did and increasing you know, from four seconds to six seconds duration of the rings is going to help your team try to catch up to Duckside and be able to take advantage and speed up the pace of the game a little bit. So I think it's a W. It's a small W at that. It's nothing you know, groundbreaking or changing in, the, in this game. We still need Jet Slide. We need stuff that's going to speed up this game a lot more. Uh, but as it stands, I'm just excited that I'm starting to see the changes starting to come through and, you know, continue that same vision mind. So let me know what you guys think, though. You guys excited for this upcoming changes? You guys excited about this change? Um, I don't think, like I said, nothing changed drastically for this one, but it's just a sign of things to come. So if you guys like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you.